So today let's talk about Trump. Trump has had a lot of stupid shit come out of his mouth and um, I guess today his camp said that he would say now that no Muslim, no Muslim should travel into the United States on a visa, on vacation, on anything. No Muslim should come into the United States. His reason? Because there is so much hatred. Hatred that has been created by the GOP, by the Republican Party, that's where the hatred has been formed, by Fox News. Does he really know how stupid he sounds? Does he understand how many Muslims are in the world? How many Muslims are in this country? Does he understand that they are of every color, every race? There is Muslims. Between him and the Republican Party, they have made this country hated by so many. If they do not hate us, they are laughing at us. We are considered one of the biggest jokes in the world. In this world, there are approximately 2.2 billion Christians. There is 1.9, I believe, billion Muslims in this world. Just because America, the USA, does not have as many Muslims as Christians doesn't mean that they are any worse. There's extreme Muslims. There are extreme Christians. Does this man understand that he sounds more and more like Hitler? And he's got a scary following out there. There is a bunch of people out there that think that Trump is great. He would be the biggest disaster in this country. I am calm because I am like dumbfounded. I am just totally dumbfounded that that statement has came out of his mouth. I am calm because I'm dumbfounded that that statement is coming out of his camp. That he is telling them to say this. I can't believe so many people are listening to him and following him. The hatred that's being created in this country because of him as well as the other Republicans. He just happens to be on in the spotlight because he is unfortunately at the top of the, he is the leading candidate in the Republican side. I am certainly hoping that it's going to be a Democrat that gets in. I don't care who. I prefer Bernie Sanders. That is, the, my, that is who I am going to vote for in the primary. I am actually going to vote in the primary for that reason. I am actually going to switch from independent because in the state of Florida, from what I understand, I can't vote for a Democrat or Republican in the primary unless I am registered. So I am going to have to re-register and become a Democrat, which I never really want to be a Democrat because I am in, I, I am in the middle. I, 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 I used to, actually I have voted Republican in the past. Not every time. And of course, when I voted for Obama the last two times, I don't look at it as a certain party. I do not, I, I have never considered myself to be within a certain party. But with how the Republicans have went in the past 12, at least 12 years, they, they, they've, just, they've just lost it. And um, I'd like to see Bernie Sanders in, and, um, but I will not vote for a Republican because every one of them have, are so screwed up. They all are promoting hate. They are making this country hate everybody. And it's wrong. For you to say there is no, that no Muslim 
should be allowed to come into this country, or you are not, you are telling them not to come to this country. Yeah, you, you basically, you're saying you're not giving a visa or anything, so you don't want them in here. Um, that is just so fucked up. You, you are so fucked up. All I have to say is, Mr. Trump, you need to learn your facts. You need to get some people that are going to teach you some facts. Because you know nothing. Go make your money ripping off poor people or whoever. But you should not be the president of this country. And I hope, I hope that you do not make it. That's all I have for today. I will see you all tomorrow with maybe something happier to talk about than something like this. Bye.